Welcome again, Keith, to Yorkshire. There's so much at the moment going on in the county. There are more universities than any other region, manufacturing centres. After London, we are the leading financial professional services city, and that, uh, I gather, now applies to digital marketing. But the whole problem with Yorkshire in general is you've heard about hiding your life under the bushel. In Yorkshire, we hide the bushel. And um, I'm therefore pleased that you've approached me through your colleagues and Think Global Growth to talk about Global Yorkshire and how Global Yorkshire can shine the light on the bushel. So what is the overall mission of Global Yorkshire, Keith? Well, I think if you look at the UK as a trading entity, I think there are two areas that really stand out in the country as centres of excellence. And one is obviously London and the other one is Yorkshire. London really doesn't need to advertise itself. Everybody internationally knows London. But I think, as you just pointed out, Yorkshire is less well known, which is a great shame for the county. And so the aim of Global Yorkshire is to promote Yorkshire as a brand globally, to encourage inward investment, and also to encourage uh, Yorkshire-based companies to get more involved with international trade. But if you would say to me, what's the overarching goal of Global Yorkshire, simply put, it's to improve the prosperity of Yorkshire, to create more jobs and to create more affluence in the region. It's now a good time to launch Global Yorkshire, Keith. Well, I think it should have been done years ago, if I'm honest, Keith. But I suppose there is an increased spotlight at the moment on international trade because of the whole Brexit debate. And what we need to do in the UK is to up our game. Um, Despite the fact that in 2015, the top 250 Yorkshire companies increased their aggregated turnover. The, the simple fact is that exports from Yorkshire dropped by 11%, which would say to me that we're not particularly trading well internationally. So we need to up our game, and Global Yorkshire can hopefully help people to do that. And what we've got to remember is that we're not just looking at trade outbound, we're looking at inward investment, foreign direct investment, And that's a very competitive game. We're not just competing against London. We're competing against Dallas. We're competing against Delhi. We're competing against Dublin. And we've got to get Yorkshire's brand out there so that when people are looking at places to invest their capital, Yorkshire's very high up on the list. How can Global Yorkshire Keith help the region um, have its voice heard better? Well, I think there are two key areas that we need to focus on. First of all, we need to give local companies who want to trade internationally access to the right kind of information, expertise, training and markets that they they need in order to achieve their international ambitions. And I think Global Yorkshire can provide that. The second area that we really need to focus on is to develop a very, very strong digital global presence for Yorkshire. And we're going to do that. through a combination of a very precise digital strategy and the expertise that we have in the region supporting that. And what we want is that when people are looking for a destination to invest in internationally, whether it be Europe or the UK specific, that what they keep seeing in their inbox is Yorkshire. What can local companies and organisations do, Kate, to help Global Yorkshire achieve its ambition? That's a really good question because what we recognise is we can't do this on our own. We really need support from the local business community. And we're really looking for three things. We're looking for sponsors who will get involved with the uh, process and help us to set up the entity in the first place. We're looking for local companies to become members in return for which they'll get access to real quality information, training and expertise. And then we're looking for local experts to get involved, who can share their expertise with local companies, with companies or organisations who want to invest in the region. And if we can pull together those three areas, I think we can create a really strong unit which can help truly promote Yorkshire on the global stage. Keith, I'm personally delighted that Think Global Growth, your colleagues there, have approached me and for me to use my brand and also my networks um, to get involved with Global Yorkshire and to ensure its success. I think it's going to be a really exciting journey that we're going on Keith and I'm really looking forward to it. Thank you Keith. Thank you.